One thing that has always been asked from our customers when purchasing is what makes the full port, standard port, and reduced port ball valves different from each other. So in today's video, we're going to discuss those differences. There is no industry standard to how these are defined, but this is the standard that our company goes by. DuraChoice offers full port, standard port, and reduced port ball valves in both stainless steel and brass. Full port ball valves, also known as full bore valves, have no restriction of flow from the original pipe diameter. This means that the full port valve will maintain a consistent flow rate. The full port design reduces cavitation and pressure drop. It has a bore opening of 90 to 100 percent. This means that for a one inch ball valve, the opening will be 0.9 to one inches. Full port ball valves recommend for pipes where both solids and liquids will be flowing through the valve. The open design reduces the amount of buildup which could affect the valve's performance over time. Standard port valves have a smaller interior diameter for a valve with the same connection size. Standard port valves cost less and usually come in the same or lower pressure ratings as full port valves. The standard port ball valve has a 10 to 25% reduced port opening. The port will have a 75 to 90% opening. This means that with the 1 inch ball valve, the size of the opening will be 0.75 to 0.9 inches. They can be just as effective in some applications where full flow is not required. The smaller opening can cause pressure drop and create cavitation causing wear on the valve. The standard port valve is good for applications that do not require a full flow. A reduced bore valve body is one of the same diameter because of the tube entering and exiting it. The significant area of the valve may be the ball within the valve body. Because the working area of the valve fits within the body, the bore with the valve ball is smaller size compared to the diameter from the valve's connecting pipe or tube. The reduced port bore opening is reduced up to 40% of the full port bore opening. This means that with the 1 inch ball valve, the opening can be as small as 0.6 inches. The reduced port valve is also good for applications that do not require a full flow. It's even cheaper than the standard port because it is smaller and lighter. To summarize, full port ball valves are good for applications that need a full flow. Its size and weight is the reason why it's the most expensive option. Standard port ball valves are reduced up to 25% of the valve and is smaller and lighter than the full port ball valve. The reduced port is further reduced than the standard port with the port being reduced up to 40% of the valve size. It's even lighter and cheaper than the standard port while also being great for applications that do not require a full flow. We hope that you were able to learn about the differences between the full port, standard port, and reduced port ball valves. To inquire about these valves, feel free to give us a call where our associates can assist you or visit our website for more information.